welcome to another video from salesberg.com in this video we shall be looking at the Genius's SPHF 1800A um, speaker system now the selling point for this speaker system is that it has 50 watt RMS to its um, specification um, also it has two um, woofers and one independent tweeter so there should be plenty of um, uh, ground for you know full full spectrum um, sound um, wooden construction uh, plenty of connectivity and so forth we shall be looking at those in details um, so and this is the box that it comes in and um, yeah it's a uh, for looking at the box it looks like it, the, the product itself is pretty big we shall be measuring it as well um, so yeah let's get started with the unboxing I'll um, undo the box and I'll be right back okay so the speakers are out of the box um, by the way they were started from packaging that's what they've used um, <coughs> inside there was a user manual a um, 3.5 in uh, 3.5 millimeter to um, to RCA cable and of course the speaker set which as I mentioned before is um, fairly hefty in size um, quite promising so without further ado let me take it out of the out of the packaging and um, <clears throat> hook it up and, and we'll see some close-ups and um, the sound quality and so forth so let's start it um, start it up okay so that's the speaker completely unpacked and everything um, as we can see the front panel is extremely shiny well polished um, and there's no mesh or anything like that the woofers are uh, boldly on display and on the top there's the uh, tweeters we spoke about earlier and of course um, they've included bass and treble controls separately there's a line in and the big dial is the volume control with the power uh, the power on off feature built into it and there's a little um, LED um, expecting it to be the power indicator so next step let's hook it up and um, test the speaker as to how it sounds okay so uh, I've made the connections to the uh, laptop over there I'll just quickly run over um, the connection points over here and what's at the back. Um, the provided RF to uh, three and a half um, millimeter cable is connected like so. There's another port for standard um, cable like so. These ones. <coughs> they do not include that by the way. I'm going to be using that later uh, for the MP3 player. Uh, and of course one cable that is hardwired to the main unit comes to the uh, other side and there are two um, ducts at the end for the air um, now let's play and listen I'll turn it up the blue LED comes on So that was the sound test done. Um, my thoughts, uh, as, as I was expecting, it is um, impressive sound, no doubt. 
plenty of power, plenty of kick to the base. Um, one thing that I was um, unsure about was the middle woofer over here. Uh, they look exactly the same as the bottom ones, but they're not the same. Apparently, these are set for mid only. These are the uh, base ones, mid, and the high end um, separately for the tweeter. Now, um, this means that you'd be getting a much flatter um, coverage throughout the uh, sound spectrum, um, <clears throat> which is a good thing. And um, it, I was just a little bit thrown out because I've seen other Genius products where uh, both the speakers are powered exactly the same. But nonetheless, I'm, what I'm not saying is that uh, the sound is wanting in any way. There is plenty of sound. It will fill any, um, you know, lounge room or anything like that with powerful, heavy sound. Um, the, the room that I'm in at this point in time is, is fairly large and um, it covered the entire room with um, pretty heavy bass sound. And I turned the bass all the way up. First I turned up the treble and then the bass and it kicked in. So yeah, um, you know, it, it pulls its uh, you know weight and, and so forth. It's very good looking, no doubt. Um, and oh, one other thing to show you is the uh, test with the MP3 player. Now, I'll just plug that in from there. And once you put it in through there, This is, this is another thing that's um, quite nice. A lot of us have MP3 players or iPhones and things like that. Just plug it in and play from the front. They don't give you this cable. You have to get that separately, but it's commonly available. Um, a good little feature. And also the uh, headphone. Uh, we often use headphones and, you know, reaching out at the back or at the case may not be very practical. So that's a, that's a good thing right there. Um, so, yeah, the, the, those are the features and um, the... Uh, overview of the Genius's SP HF 1800A speaker set. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Um, for more videos and um, unboxing videos and so forth, please visit us at www.salesberg.com. Thank you for watching this video. Hope to see you next time.